so you can see how I've trimmed the, the top and bottom level here. The parallel. And so the end result with the bases that I'm going to pour as well will also be level if I get it level in this stage. <clears throat> so that's all I need to do here and I'm going to go ahead and do the the other two models that I have here. Um, I also trimmed off this excess here and just tried to trim it up make it look as, as neat as I can for, uh, um, for right now. And so we'll do the same thing on the next two that I have. After we've trimmed our bases or our um, die models and our posings on the model trimmer, I want to trim off this rough um, arch area here of each model. Um, I don't want any undercut areas when I trim this off and I'm going to use my arbor band here on my lathe. Remember we're going to be setting these in a base, a wet, uh, there's going to be a di um, lab stone that we're going to, be, a wet lab stone that we will be placing these models into later on. And they may sink into that wet stone a little bit. So we don't want any undercut areas when we have to separate them from that lab stone. Um, plus it'll look much nicer when we trim this excess off. Um, so that's what I'm going to start doing now. I'm going to demonstrate that. Okay, that's all I need to do there. Um, now I will brush this off and clean them up underwater and move on to the uh, my machine where we will set our dowel pin holes into the bottom of these die models. <laughs> 